Your girl is here today to show you darlings how I created this beautiful half up half down curly lock style. Now this style is special because it is a two for one style. This is going to be the first part of how I did this fabulous nest nest so definitely stay tuned for the second video which will be the huge reveal on the end result of this two for one style i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how to section your hair for this particular style because i accidentally deleted the footage so i'm gonna try and explain it to you guys today fairly simple um there are four sections that you have to do this style and there are four parts that you're going to make all of the parts are going to go to the center of your head okay um so we're going to have one section in the front of course two sections on the sides and one in the back okay and the first thing i did was section the top part make my two parts in the top um, my son's right here with me, so if you hear a little bit of rattling, he's playing, so yeah. Um, there's a part that goes right here to the middle of my head, and there is a part that goes right here to the middle of my head, which creates this section right here at the front. See these two parts? I have a part here going to the middle of my head, then I have a part here going to the middle of my head, which creates this side section. And a part here going to the middle of my head part here going to the middle of my head and it creates this side section okay um, so once you have all four of your sections created you want to go ahead and just tie them just separate them tie them up plait them twist them put them in a little ponytail and then we're gonna move right into the first step which is doing a crisscross so hope you guys um, understood that pretty simple just sectioning your hair with this particular style so I'll just put this up and tie it up and I'll start with the back section here and doing my pipe cleaner curls once I get to the top of my head I'm gonna come in and show you guys how I do my I already have some pipe cleaners that are already pre-made because girl ain't nobody got time to be doing that I use use them over and over again yes I do so I take a lock put a little bit of product on there just a little bit. I just can see what I'm doing. Okay. And I clip it out of the way. You can see my hair. Okay. So I twist it. I'm trying to make sure none of my other hair get into the lock, you know? So I twist my little lock just like that. See? It's twisted. So I take my pipe cleaner. And this is a long lock, so I'm a lean, I'm a lean back. Anyway, we're gonna get into it. I'm a lean back. Anyway, we're gonna get into it. Um, so I take a little bit, I start with a little bit, and I twist it around at the bottom, not tightly at all, and boom. Okay, then we're just gonna go ahead and start rolling this up. You know how your mama used to do rollers back in the day? They used to roll their hair up. Mm -hmm. But we ain't putting these tight. We just gonna roll it. Anyways. 
keep it moving and then see this little bottom we i don't like that sticking out because i'm y'all gonna understand in a minute i usually just go ahead and bend it under i bend it just like that see bend it boom all right and i roll it look i roll it really loosely see I roll it loosely and then once I roll a little bit, I just slide it down like that. See how condensed that just became? Okay, and I continue. Roll it, just roll it on around, around and around it goes. Not tight at all, and then I just slide it down. I just slide it down like that. So I roll it, because I don't like mine to be tight. This makes an awesome curl though, y'all. I'm trying to tell you, see? Boom. I roll it loosely and then I just slide it down like because when I take these out I want it to be easy I want it to just slide out you hear me you feel me like you slide out the house when you fly as a mug when you about to step out with your homies you just gonna slide out anyway I'm doing the most um so yeah now I'm down to the root with that one I want to come to the front. I just wanted to show you guys how I do the really long ones. And see how that condensed down to such a small. And I do do one pipe cleaner per per um, per lock because for me, I find I get the best curls when I do that. My curls last longer. And my curls actually last almost a month. And I'm going to I'm going to explain to you guys in a minute exactly why, okay? Rock with you. So I cut the access pipe cleaner off. Yes, I did. <laughs> no, I did not cut my hair, girl. I've been doing this for a long time. Make sure you don't cut your hair, okay? Make sure. Don't be hitting me up like, can you I didn't cut my hair. I was trying to do what you're doing. Girl, take your time. Take your time, boo. Follow these instructions here. Okay, so I got my hair tied back because I kind of don't want them to be in the way while I'm doing the front. So, we're going to start with the easier part. We're going to do this one right in the middle of my head. This peak, okay? So, we're going to show, I'm going to show you one more again how I do these, all right? One more time. Because, um, and you know, you pretty much just do the same thing. Do a little bit of product on my hair at the root before I retwist it. And you pretty much do the same thing. The very same method that I'm using here doing my pipe cleaners um, curls are the same method that I use starting from the back going all the way up. I just waited until I got to the front so I can show you guys how I do it because it's much easier to do that once I get up to the front. You know what I mean? So, yeah. Now look at this little teeny pipe cleaner look. Look, look this is a little one. It's a little baby one. I'm about to use this baby one on this one here because y'all already know. Look at this one. Okay, I do not want to have to cut it. Like if I said, I don't I have I'll to. leave a little bit. See? All right, and I just twist it around my lock, just like so. Just twist it around. All right, and once I twist the end around, I just go ahead and start twirling like I'm doing some rollers. You know, like your grandmama do rollers. Anyway, I'm doing the most. Um, and I just start twisting. And I'm, it's, this is not tight around this pipe cleaner at all. I can't stand that. Um, see, it is very loose, look. It's very loose, so I just slide it down. Like that, condense it down. And what I didn't do is flip this under, this little piece over, so I'm gonna flip that right now because sometimes you can make a mistake and just slide it off when you're sliding it down. So I like to just fold over that little piece at the end, right at the beginning, because I know that I'm gonna be sliding this as I'm twirling. So this is what I do, twirl loosely, and then I just slide it down like so. See how condensed it gets? Makes awesome curls. Y'all gonna see though. Y'all gonna see boo boo. See? Slide it down. Not tight at all around the pipe cleaner. See? Loosely. And I just slide it down. And I just slide it down. And I slide it, slide it down. All the way to the end. And then I have a little piece that I just fold. See, this one's really short, so I'm not gonna cut this because it's really short. These are specifically for these locks. So I just kind of wrap it around a little bit. So I just kind of wrap it around the root right there. See, that little baby 
um, pipe when a girl right there. Mm -hmm. And that's gonna really hang right there. I'm gonna show y'all in a minute. So y'all, girl, it's finished, okay? I am done, y'all. As you can see, I've completed all of my little pipe cleaners. All the way around, boo, okay? And I still have my crisscross on the side, okay? Now, what I'm gonna do now, now that I am done all of my pipe cleaners, I'm gonna go ahead, I have one that I forgot to cut. You see that one? I need to cut that. Y'all, get y'all some heavy duty scissors to cut y'all pipe cleaners for real though, because these little two dollar scissors I got, <laughs> feel like they about to break. You yeah. heard I'm just trying to let y'all know. So what I'm gonna do is, the lovely thing about pipe cleaners are that they bend to your liking, and that's what I'm about to do right now because I am not taking these out. I told y'all earlier that I'm not about that life, okay? I don't want mine, um, like, I don't want to sit in the dryer, so I'm just gonna create now, a bag Now what I've here. decided to do is, I've created a little section for a bang. I'm gonna take this little, this is actually a, the same thing I had on earlier. And um, y'all gonna see, I'm gonna tie it around my hair. Because these little pipe cleaner curls, I'm leaving these in, okay? I tie them in around just like you see. Putting in a little bow. I'm gonna do something slick and I'm just gonna bend these frontward to kind of like cover up the little, uh, to cover this up right here. That's what I'm gonna do. for about two days so I'm just rolling see I just rolled those up to kind of like cover up the little band that I have on there holding these back and I'm just rolling them really now I'm just rolling them down like they short anyway so I'm just rolling them down like that see this one I'm just gonna roll it down just like a little ball into a little ball and that's the thing about pipe cleaners like they're so like they 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 bend, you know, they bend and however you bend them, that's how they stay. That's what I love about them. So when I never whenever I do curls for a style, this is exactly what I do. I just I leave them in for a couple of days and I'm definitely so gonna wear. What wet you this. pretty much do is just bend them to your liking so that it looks presentable and it looks good. Um and then you can just leave them in for a couple of days. If you ask me this is a style in itself. Pretty much done. I did, the reason I put the little band on there is because I wanted my, my um, crisscross to show on the side. And y'all know how long my locks is. And if this ain't condensing, I don't know what is, okay? I don't know what is. I am going to is. come back in a couple of days and I'm gonna show you guys how this style looks when I take off the pipe cleaners because that really is the end result. It's just that when I do my pipe cleaners, I do not sit under the dryer. I don't have time for that, okay? So I just do something like I like you see here. And I just leave it for a couple of days. So thank you guys so much for watching. It is your girl, the one and only, coming through in the clutch as per usual. Well. Um, please, guys, help your girl get some exposure. Share this video on all your social media platforms. Thumbs up the video. Share it with all of your friends who have locks. Let them know about the fabulousness nest that is going down over here. Okay, comment down below. Let me know what you think about this style, this two for one style. Uh, subscribe. Turn on your notifications so that you never miss an upload from me. And if, girl, you see my Christmas decorations video, that's because I love y'all, boo. <laughs> anyway, I'm doing the most as per usual. So it's your girl, Kenyatta, yeah. Y'all know I love y'all. And until next time, y'all stay fabulous, okay?